Yeah. Morning, this is uh, Netherhall School uh, breakfast provision. Uh, I'm going to show you around, uh, introduce you to some of the staff who are doing it, and also introduce you to some of the students who are chucking into a free breakfast as well. Okay, so uh, we'll introduce you to some of the people. This is uh, young Blake Wassell. Blake, what do you have for breakfast? Uh, granola, yogurt, and berries. Granola, yogurt, and berries. Fabulous. Uh, Blake, uh, how do you find it? Uh, good. I have it every morning now. It just is a massive help with their home because we don't actually leave the house early and mom get to work a bit early. Brilliant, so it works for everybody. Yeah. You get into school early, mum gets to work yeah. early, you get a nutritious and healthy yeah. breakfast. Yeah. Brilliant. Thank you very much, Blake. Anybody else would like to be interviewed? Nathan, come on. Brilliant, Nathan. This is, a, this is the excellent day for that kid's son. That's it. Uh, Nathan, how do you find breakfast on a morning? Plus. Plus, why? Because it fills me up. It fills you up? Good. Go on. Go on. And does it set you up for the day? Yeah. Brilliant. What time do you get into school on the morning, Nathan? Uh, before eight. Before eight. eight. Yeah, you, you've got it about five to eight. All right. Brilliant. So you think it's a great thing having a morning breakfast? Yeah. Brilliant. Well done. Thank you very much, Nathan. Super job. Don't lose your place in the queue. Um, I'm just going to introduce you to some of the staff now. This is uh, oh, uh, hello, Miss Lawson. This is Miss Lawson. Even the staff take advantage of this. And um, I just, just pan over onto that for me, sir. I mean, can you believe it? They go through four bags of granola, Greek yogurt, honey, um, fruit compote. They can't get enough of it. It's not just tea and toast and uh, hot chocolate and jam. It's uh, a full range of uh, fruit juices and everything. This is young Joel Wassell here. Joel, how would you like breakfast, the breakfast summer morning? Good. Yeah. Go on, why? You're a star at Cabra. Brilliant, that's it. And do you enjoy having it with your friends? Yes. Right, excellent. Thank you very much. Yes, sir. Thank you. Just come back out, just want to introduce you to This is Nathan Kirkbride. Do you enjoy breakfast Sunday morning, Nathan? Right, fabulous. Thank you, Nathan. So, this is uh, Dale Stevenson. He's the business manager. Comes in, gives up his time, gets in here at uh, 7.30 on the morning so he can set the breakfast up and works his way through about 13 loaves of bread, toasting it. Uh, the kitchen staff all give their time, so the kitchen staff in the background all come in early and help out as well. Uh, and that means that we get really good value for money because we don't spend any money on, on staffing or uh, those costs, but everything that we spend is just upon supplying the uh, healthy, nutritious breakfast for all the students. Yeah, Owen, come here. This is Owen. <laughs> How do you like breakfast on the morning, Owen? There's the camera. Good wife. Pardon? <laughs> Pardon? It's good. Do you like having breakfast with your friends, Owen? Yeah. Yeah. He's a natural in front of the camera. <laughs> right, we'll have a look round. Nathan's already a star. So look, Mr. Bell, he's on duty every morning, so that he looks after. So the breakfast provision starts at 7.45 and it runs to 8.25. Uh, so the students have got 40 minutes to come down, sit with their friends and get a healthy breakfast. Okay, guys, morning. How did we get over rugby yesterday, Charlie? Yeah. Right, we got beats. Never mind. Hopefully, go on, Coburn, go through. Hopefully, we can sort that out. Come on, there, sir. Come on, Charlie. It's good. Declan Denwood, BWD. breakfast on the morning. This guy's a superstar athlete. Needs a breakfast on the morning to keep his training program up. Don't you, Declan? Yeah. Good. 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 Any reason why? Free food, good. Lucas has five yogurts, 16 rounds of toast, four hot chocolate, three bowls, three bowls of granola, growing all morning. Look at him. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, well, uh, Ethan and Seth there are not having the breakfast and playing a, a, an impromptu game of chess at the same time. That's how you should start spend your breakfast. Just in the for this morning. So all the drinks are free as well, so so the students can have uh, hot chocolate, tea, coffee, whatever. Some of them even have an espresso. 
Chief Japan was in charge of the kitchen, and Helen, the fantastic uh, second in command in the kitchen. Um, okay, um, Gail, uh, Pam, Helen, and the ladies all do uh, give the, up the time in the morning for free so that basically all of the money that we get given for breakfast provision gets spent on uh, the on breakfast uh, stuffs. Hey, come in, young man, go on, carry on. Um, and um, so it means we get really good value for money, and of course it's done in a brilliant way as well. So, what's your take on it, man? Yeah, Helen? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they go the holiday in, don't they? Yeah. 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 So fantastic. It wouldn't happen without these people making it happen, so it's really appreciated. This man's having an apple for breakfast. Granola, green yogurt and honey. That's fabulous breakfast. Very basic. Yeah, and we already introduced Dale on toast. Yeah. <laughs> we'll just have set the students up for a really good day at school. Attendance at the school has improved dramatically over the course and it sits now significantly above the national average, which um, is, is the first time that we've done that. Um, so again, it's having a really great knock-on effect in terms of giving students not only a great start to the day, getting them into school early uh, and getting them in school as well to be in lessons as well. So it's been brilliant. Right.